Hi, welcome to the Cocktail Vlog. I'm Steve the Bartender, and today I'm gonna to show you how to make a black Manhattan. So Negroni week is upon us, and I've got a lot of cool cocktails lined up. A lot of Negroni variations that you probably haven't heard of, uh, but if you're keen to get started on some Negroni riffs, then I'll link to the unusual Negroni and the white Negroni just up here. But for today, I'm gonna to get started on this black uh, Manhattan, which uh, was first created in San Francisco at Bourbon and Branch by Todd Smith. And it's a simple variation on the Manhattan, substituting the sweet vermouth for a Verna. So the Averna is a Italian Amaro. It's a, a bitter herbal liqueur, um, but it's balanced out by a bit of sweetness. So it's moderately bitter, herbal, and it's got notes of orange peel in there too. So for the Black Manhattan, it's completely up to you if you choose to uh, pour a bourbon or a rye whiskey. Uh, but today I'm gonna use a bourbon. Start by measuring out 60 mil, two ounces, and add that straight into your mixing glass. Followed by 30 mil, one ounce of Averna. And two dashes of bitters. So I'm gonna do a combination of Angostura and orange bitters. If you don't have an orange bitters, then you can just simply do two dashes of Angostura. So fill the mixing glass with ice and give it a stir for about 30, 40 seconds. So you've probably noticed that the, uh, the shelving's changed. Um, I'm not sure if it looks a little bit too busy, but let me know in the comments below what you think, if you think it's better or worse. Yeah, some of these Negroni variations that I'll, I'll be posting later this week, um, there's one in particular that I think you guys are gonna love it. So make sure you like and subscribe, hit the bell button so you don't miss out, and that'll be coming out in the next couple of days. Of course, make sure you've got your, your coupe glass or your stem cocktail glass set aside, a cube of ice or in the fridge, make sure it's chilling down. So into the chilled coupe it goes. and garnish with a cherry. Oop. Stay put. So they have a black Manhattan. Cheers. You can definitely understand where it gets its name from. Uh, I'll show you a close up on this, this camera here. It's a really dark, intense Manhattan. Uh, normally in the Manhattan is obviously with a sweet vermouth and it's got more of a, a red, bright, vibrant color. And this kind of looks dark and mysterious. Oh, I like that. I like the herbal addition to the Manhattan without being, it's adding some bitterness and some complexity without being overwhelming or overpowering. I like this one. If you're a Manhattan fan and you've got a bottle of Averna, give this one a try. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you soon for another cocktail video. Cheers.